March 13th is the Sunday of Orthodoxy for the Orthodox Christian Church. It is the first Sunday of Great Lent. The dominant theme of this Sunday since 843 CE has been that of the victory of the icons. In that year, the iconoclastic controversy, which had raged on and off since 726 CE, was finally laid to rest and icons and their veneration were restored on the first Sunday of Lent. Ever since, this Sunday has been commemorated as the triumph of orthodoxy. The Seventh Ecumenical Council dealt predominantly with the controversy regarding icons and their place in orthodox worship. It was convened in Nicaea in 787 by Empress Irene at the request of the Patriarch of Constantinople. The council was attended by 367 bishops. Almost a century before this, the iconoclastic controversy had once more shaken the foundations of both church and state in the Byzantine Empire. Excessive religious respect and the ascribed miracles to icons by some members of society approached the point of worship, which is due only to God, and therefore idolatry. This instigated excesses at the other extreme, by which icons were completely taken out of the liturgical life of the church by the iconoclasts. The iconophiles, on the other hand, believed that icons served to preserve the doctrinal teaching of the church. They considered icons to be man's dynamic way of expressing the divine through art and beauty. The council decided on a doctrine by which icons should be venerated but not worshipped. In answering the Empress's invitation to the council, Pope Hadrian replied with a letter in which he also held the position of extending veneration to icons but not worship, the last befitting only God. A regional synod was called in Constantinople in 843 CE under Empress Theodora. The veneration of icons was solemnly proclaimed at the Hagia Sophia Cathedral. The Empress, her son Michael III, Patriarch Methodios, and monks and clergy came in procession and restored the icons in their rightful place. The day was called Triumph of Orthodoxy. Since that time, this event is commemorated yearly with a special service on this first Sunday of Lent, the Sunday of orthodoxy. Hey, thanks for watching our video. If you like what you see, please subscribe to our channel and click on the bell for new content notifications. Share it with your family and friends. And as always, please share your questions and comments with us as well. By helping support us, you are helping us to build bridges to spiritual support, not just in our hospital community, but in the world beyond. Thanks for your help as we reach out to those around us.